Hey everyone and welcome to this video where I'm going to show you how to make a hay dispenser. Please enjoy. So the main thing you'll need for this project is a water butt. Mine's personally um, 210 litres. It doesn't really matter what litre it is, it just depends how much hay you want to store. So the first thing I did is draw the hole in the middle of the um, water butt where I wanted the circle to be. The circle that would be dispersing the hay. I then got an old pair of headphones, cut the actual headphones out, placed the aux cord in the hole I just made, and wrapped the rest of the wire around the pen. I then drew the pen round in a circle, which perfectly stayed the same diameter all the way around. Where you made the circle, drill holes all the way around the circle, which you can use as points to start as cu the cutting. I personally use a jigsaw because it's the most manoeuvrable saw I have in my house, but you can use anything like a hacksaw or maybe even a chainsaw. Here you can see the hole isn't the straightest but it doesn't really matter because you're just going to pit a wire mesh all the way behind it. Around the outside of the circle you just made, drill holes in about 10 centimeter gaps. You're going to use these to cable tie the mesh to the actual barrel. Bend the mesh you're going to be using to a certain degree, just so it fits to the shape of the barrel that you're using. Place your mesh where you want it to stay on the barrel, and just place some cable ties in the holes that you've already drilled. Lightly secure the cable ties to the mesh, which will secure the mesh to the barrel. You have to do it lightly so that when you want to kind of maybe move it around a bit, you still have slack to do that. When you think you've got your mesh in the right place, tighten up the cable ties so there's no move movement in the mesh. Once everything is secure, cut the ends off the cable ties so that it looks nicer, and just push the mesh in so it fits to the bow a bit better. Thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope you build your own cool hay feeder, and if you have any questions, please leave it in the comments.